Hey, this is Brett, and this 2017 Chrysler Pacifica Tourina L is stock number 13544Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used minivan and Pacifica headquarters. This 2017 Chrysler Pacifica Tourina L has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. It's paired up with the nine speed automatic transmission. This van has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop per the state of Wisconsin inspection process. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and it is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video. Inside, start it up, take a look under the hood, show you all the seats work and stuff in it give you a good representation of the vehicle. Uh, billet silver is it the color, and I shoot all my videos in 4K, so if you have HD capabilities, turn them on now because it is your best way to check out the quality, condition, options, and cleanliness of the van before seen in person. As you go down the driver's side here, you can see the doors and rear quarter are all in very nice condition. The front Fender is in nice shape as well, and if you like the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash Summit Auto. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. This one comes with the 18-inch painted alloy wheels, and it has Goodyear Assurance Max Life tires. These are two 3560 R18s, and I would say that they have probably about 80 to 90% of the tread left on them, so very new tires on this van. Coming around the front here, you can see you do get the projector lamp headlamps, LED running lights, and projector lamp fog lamps, all part of that Touring L package. You can see the front bumper has never been drilled into, and it is in pretty nice shape. Does have the, the grill is in nice shape, and the headlights are nice and clear. Uh, one thing to note on the hood here is that there is no corrosion on the lips, on the lip of the hood here, or the edges. These uh, Pacifica hoods are known to do that, so this one is in really nice shape, probably because it was down south most of its life, um, but always something to look at. But this one's in perfect condition. Passenger side front fender is in absolutely great condition, and the passenger side front wheel is in nice shape as well. As you go down this side of this 2017 Chrysler Pacifica, take note of how clean the body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the van, hear the van, and have confidence in the vehicle you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you do that, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, and that Brett sent you back wheel. Excellent condition as well, and the back tires have just as much tread as the front tires. Coming around to the back of the vehicle, the rear bumper is in great shape. Didn't see any major cracks or dents on it. There is just a little bit of light duty usage, um, but nothing too bad. Backup parking sensors, the rear gate is in nice condition as well and it is a power lift gate. The back storage area is very nice and clean. You do get a lot of storage back here. These seats do go, do go down. Um, you gotta pull the one first, and then this number two strap, and then that goes just like so, and you can see just how nice and flat that goes. Now that second row, you can remove that seat, and then the Outside seats do store into the floor. To get this back up, just grab this strap, pull it like so, and you're all set to go. So pretty nice system to get this gate closed. Press that button, it'll beep at you three times and then begin its descent. For full disclosure, this back wheel is in nice shape. No major scuffs or scrapes in there. And as you go down the rest of this side, once again, doors look really good. Does have the enter and go system. You get blind spot monitoring in the mirrors, heated mirrors. Inside, the Tourinel package gives you the black leather interior. You get the captain's chairs in the front. There are no rips or tears on the seats. They are in very nice condition. Power driver's seat, factory floor mats, auto headlamps, tilt telescopic steering wheel, power windows, locks, and mirrors. Second row, power sliding door. 
That works nicely. Second row bench seating. No rips or tears back here. It does have the latch child safety system for any child car seats you may have. You get factory floor mats back here as well. This one does have the rear air controls, which are right there. And then you get the side window shades for the second row and the third row. So that's pretty neat. So to get to the third row, they have a special handle on here. So it kind of slides the seat forward a little bit and then angles it or tilts it, I should say. Third row seats are in excellent shape. No rips or tears back there. Notice that it does have a spot for uh, child safety seats as well. Carpeting is in nice shape. And then to get the seat back down, you just kind of push it back and it snaps into place. So this one does have the stow and go assist. So basically you press this button and it'll move that power driver seat forward to the point where you can get this seat into the floor. So once it is in to where it needs to go, it'll stop. You just lift this tray up like so. You probably should take the floor mat off first. But once you do that, this goes up like so, and it stays into place like that. And then you just uh, pull the stow and go strap, which is right there. And you can see that those just kind of slide down into the floor, which is actually a pretty neat system. You just put this tray back like so, and you're ready to go. So that's how that works to get it back out. Just kind of lift that back up. Once again, pull the stones, go strap, and it'll pull up like so, and put the backrest up, put the piece down like so, and then you're all set. Put your floor mat in, which they have the snaps there, so it goes right into place. Press the stone go assist button again and it'll put the seat back to where it was originally. Close that second or that door in the back here. We'll hop inside, check out the miles radio and everything that this van has to offer on the interior. You can see that this one has 53,904 miles. Uh, you get the really nice blue hue from the instrument cluster digital speedometer on there. It does have the uh, time display on there as well. And the instrument cluster is very nice and clean. This one comes with the leather wrapped steering wheel. You get the cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left. And that steering wheel is in excellent shape. I didn't see any major rips or tears or wear on it. This one has the 8.4 4C radio. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. Uh, you have he your heated seat buttons here. This one does have the factory navigation system, and you can see that that is working nicely. There is Highway 41 on there. You get all your different apps on here. And uh, actually, I think this is a 3C radio. My bad. Anyways, um, get all your different apps there as well. This is your 9-speed automatic transmission. Um, rotary shifter, dual climate controls, start stop capability, stability control. You get the gloss black dash and keyless entry right here. You get remote start, power sliding side doors, and power lift gate buttons as well. Passenger side floor mat and seat are in fantastic condition. I didn't see any rips or tears on there. And the headliner is in nice condition as well. You do get map lights right there as well as door controls and rear gate controls, 911 and assist buttons, and it does have the home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. We'll start it up and take a look under the hood. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. Note you do get a range to empty up there as well, and I think you can change those to read pretty much whatever you want. And uh, 
I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video you've been able to verify the quality condition options and of course cleanliness of this van all the way around. You can see those LED running lights, projector lamp, headlamps and fog lamps are working nicely as well. Under the hood we have the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. Once again, this van has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and it is 100% ready to go. There is the emissions sticker. It's got really new tires on it as well. And to see more pictures of this van or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it, we gotta go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more minivan, Chrysler Pacifica vehicles like this one in the upper right, link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we're super excited to help you with this Ultra Clean 2017 Chrysler Pacifica Touring L in billet silver metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it.